Well, hello there. I am Stephanie Canada. No, wait a second. Don't leave. I know I'm not who you were expecting. I realize that you were expecting none. However, can I offer you a white dog? Hang on a second. <laughs> White dog! Okay, here's the deal. So, Nani reached out to me quite a while back, more so than I would like to admit, and asked if I wanted to do a collaboration, and I said, sure, let's talk about so it. So what we landed on is I found a pattern in my shop that was d Dutch, uh, d d a language I don't speak. I sent her that, and then she shipped me some 1950s German pattern magazines, which you'll be watching me attempt to make over on my channel, Stephanie Canada, while she attempts to make the pattern that I sent her from the US. Can I help you? So I just wanted to give you that little quick bit, and here is Nani for a little bit more of the making process. Here it is. The magnificent sewing pattern Simplicity 1949 from 1978 with no English instructions. Only Dutch. My Dutch is minimal. The year crisp over her half an imperative. Your mom. For prima resultat, you brought Simplicity Kakia papier. Um patron kittens of the start to offer the bringen. It's a very cute dress slash pinafore. I'm gonna make this one. I have the most perfect fabric for this project. This cotton something resist dye with real indigo. That is the most perfect thing I've ever seen. And I got this as a gift from a friend of mine. Julian, thank you. I finally get to wear your beautiful fabric. It's beautiful. It's gorgeous. It needs to be washed separately because the flower goes to turn really, really white. So the first time that I wash this dress, I will have to wash it in the bathtub and I will lose a lot of dye. Here you can and see how white it will turn once I wash it. Scary. There will be a lot of <laughs> 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 Sorry, it will be a lot of dye. Ooh. E. Ah. Ooh. <laughs> no. Hello there. The pattern pieces are written in English, but they did not bother to make English instructions. I'm not that crazy after all. It's called a frill. So a frillily is the frill. Bodice. Ooh, look, the shoulder strap is curved. It has a 1.5 centimeter seam allowance that is already marked, which I love. This has to be very straightforward. Things that are supposed to be cut on the fold are not on the fold, but I will trace them on the fold because I want to save paper. Paper. Tracing wheel. I need to, I need to press this. Yeah. One pressing later. It's totally the same day, okay? Um, <laughs> some of you already know that we are renovating our bathroom. This is water damage. <laughs> we have wallpaper in the bathroom, which is totally weird for me, but I want to change it because it's boring and I hate it. So I took my tracing wheel upstairs to score the paper so I can remove it better and I forgot to bring it down. <sighs> yes, I'll go upstairs. <gasps> Man, man, don't care. Our bathroom will be taken apart to and I'm happy because we have no bathroom. Ha <laughs> I managed to fold it as it was. Oh my god. So exciting. One tracing later. All, all, the, all the pattern pieces that I wanted. I didn't trace the skirt. Noted all the measurements so I can have the same shape as the original. Let's cut it twice. Oh no, it's dirty. Oh, I need to buy more white fabric. One cutting later. Well, I cut a lining for the stiff frillily that I didn't need to, but now I will have a lined frillily. Very exciting. Put this together and see what changes will need to be done. I'll be right back. Oh, I forgot to mark the notches for for the sleeve installation because I thought this was the upper part so I marked the notches here but I didn't mark the notches here because who needs notches on the skirt right now I have to unpack a beautifully packed pattern and find the notch but the size is perfect I don't need any changes I might need to shorten mm. these things a little bit but the rest is very very good very good <laughs> one notching later
My fingers are turning blue from the dye. <laughs> Attached. It's cute, but I need to change it. It's too big for me and it will keep falling off. I hate when that happens. There's a very annoying bee here. She's huge and I'm scared. Deadly allergic and all. Oh, no, not the bees! Not the bees! Ah! Ha! It's so cute. No idea what happened with the camera, but I was looking like a ghost. I think now it's better. Bodice is done. I already cut the skirt and I made one change. I allowed myself to make one change. Because the skirt had a seam right in the center front and I didn't make any sense. One big panel on the fold, two panels for the back for the zipper insertion and the frillies that need to be tied together. <sighs> And install. I want to finish this today, but I really don't feel like gathering fabric. So I will just work on the upper part of the skirt and see how it goes from there. If I feel like it, then I will continue. gonna start embracing my crazy hair days because I really don't feel like doing my hair. I need to re -dye it though. It's so faded. I love this dress. I absolutely love this dress. I love the fact that it is very flowy, although there isn't much fabric here because we only need to gather the skirt here and here is straight. Light and flowy dress. The straps are still kind of too big for me and I need to figure this out. The inner waistline is fine, kind of giving me that pregnancy look because it's a very high empire. Like my nips are here and this is where the empire comes. I would totally wear this a lot. <laughs> we always the way. Is this a place that you just need to lay down like under the tripod? You're always in the way, cachorro. Look at this snoot. Look at this very boobable snoot. The biggest and the pinkest snoot in the world. I just need to cut my feet today. The thing I hate the most about chunky zippers is that they are a hell to close on your own. Stop it. Straps. I like this with the tank top. Maybe I just can use it like this. So we pretend it's intentional. And I do realize that when I wash this, this white details will become blue. It was too late. <laughs> it is what it is. What do you think of this dress? And it's comfortable. This is the toddler look. I still think it's very toddlerish. Just gave up on life like this. So much emotional damage. In my next life, I want to be a dog. Just laying there, not having a care in the world. I was planning on shooting this in the garden today, but the guys from the bathroom are still here and I'm kind of embarrassed. So like being there frolicking and they coming in and out with materials and everything. So I'm, I'm doing this inside. But it's getting warmer. I will be able to wear this too. I'm very happy. I'm very, very happy. It's so cute. How did I do? How did I do? I am giving this pattern away to one of my subscribers. So if you're interested, let me know. I will rent pick one of the interested bacons and I will send you this for free. It's a very nice pattern. These are the measurements. If you can read Dutch. I have no idea. 104 is the bus measurement. So if you are 104 or if you wish to grade the pattern yourself, let me know and I'll send you this for free. Thank you so much to Stephanie Canada for sending me this wonderful pattern. Check her out. Link in the description and somewhere here on the screen. I love you all. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoy these shenanigans, then check the one down below because I think you're going to like it. <laughs> I'm ridiculous. I'm a lion. Ta-ta. <sighs> when you try to be funny, 